we're going to look at how to block an IP and here we're going to be using an if else statement to do that alongside a for each but first of all we're going to assign an IP in an array okay we're going to give an array of an IP now let's say let's give an IP and we're going to say uh, IP have an array of um let's just um put the local host IP for now let's go on to seven the zero the zero the one and um, we have um let's just give other um ips for now even if they are not real okay let's just that's for testing purposes okay and um one more here we have um let's say um zero zero dot um one nine nine dot two one two dot zero zero two for instance now this is a list of ip that we want to block from our assessing our website so now what we're going to do is this is our website right here so we're going to use the for each var um, for each loop to declare that now what we're going to do here is since our ip here has an array we're going to say for each for each IP as um, let's declare another statement let's say for each IP as um, let's say proxy for instance um, okay we want to do something okay now for each IP as proxy let's say echo echo we're going to echo this IP okay I don't know if you get that but if you don't get it just follow us now we're going to echo IP and we're going to concatenate that with um, a break tag so as to enable it to be listed um, under each other okay so we're going to concatenate that with a BR tag and a semicolon there now let's quickly refresh our page and see what we'll get now uh oh we have an error there okay um yeah i'm seeing the mistake now this is supposed to be echo proxy okay not ip so let's echo proxy and see now let's go back to our browser and refresh that now echo proxy you see a list of our uh, a proxy uh, ip sorry listed on our browser okay so now what we're going to do is we want to restrict those ips from accessing our website so we're going to erase this particular line and we're going to introduce an if else statement now we're going to say we're going to say if okay we're going to say if um proxy now if proxy is equal to now if proxy is equal to the address that is the ip of the current um system of the current uh, uh, computer you're working on now if ip is equal to address okay we want to do something now what we're going to do is um we're just simply going to die the page okay now we don't want to do any other thing we just want to die the page and leave it like that okay so now let's refresh that and see what we get now we'll refresh i've changed the address to the address that it echoed to the browser initially and now we're doing that again say if proxy is equal to the address of your browser then it should kill the page at that point okay that is to say you don't want the person to access that page which is underneath your script okay your uh, code up here so now what we're going to do now to make it look more um, nice looking is to just um echo or die a particular statement now let's say we want to die um sorry okay sorry your your ip is restricted okay now that's what i want to die so we'll just save that and refresh the page and you see that your ip is what restricted it echoes what the die statement so take a look at that and mind you we change this to we change it from a one to seven zero zero one to this which was the initial thing that the browser echoed to us to be our 
IP of our local host. So look at that, look at it very well. That's how to grab and block the IP of a particular client or a particular IP from accessing your website. Okay, I'll take a very good look at it. I'll see you in the next video.